Hey everybody, welcome in. It's Roger with you. If you're at my website and you've clicked on one of the audio examples and it did not open in Windows Media Player, then we need to talk about that for a minute because that's what I want them to open in. Windows Media Player. All right. So if you did click on an audio link and it didn't open in Windows Media Player, I want you to open your Windows Media Player now. Okay. And once you have it open, I want you to go to Tools. Go to Options, and I want you to click on the File Types tab. Okay, now if for some reason the MP3 audio file type field box is not chosen, that just means that that particular type of file is being opened with another program. I want you to choose it so it will open in Windows Media Player every time. Okay, so once you've chosen it, hit Apply, close out by hitting OK and you have now associated the mp3 file type with Windows Media Player so when you click on an audio example on my website it should open in Windows Media Player now from time to time other programs will kind of want to become the default player for that type of file type in which case you need to do what we just did again open up Windows Media Player go to tools options file types and again choose the field box that says mp3 and you'll be back in business now here's the reason why Windows Media Player has a play speed setting function that is very important uh, to me for you to learn these examples by alright and here's where it is let's find it under view enhancements play speed settings click on that it will open up the play speed setting function alright I might want you to go ahead and uh, deselect the snap slider to common speeds function. I want you to be able to freely move this slider to the left and to the right. And this is going to allow you to slow down and speed up all of the examples on my website. So I'm going to click on one here. This is just a little blues example. All right. All right. Could be anything really. Could be an acoustic guitar strummed pattern. Could be some kind of a heavy metal two hand tapping lick or whatever it is. Whatever the case. But here's the thing. When you move the slider to the left, you can slow the file down. So you could learn it at a reduced rate, which is hugely important when you're trying to learn something. And once you master it, well, we feel free to go ahead and speed it back up to where it was. Or maybe even make it faster. So you get the idea. This is hugely important and it's a great tool when learning new things just to slow them down a little bit so you could keep up. Anyways, that's how we do it. And again, if you are opening any of the audio examples on my website, are clicking on any of the audio links and they're not opening in Windows Media Player. This is what you need to do to make that happen. Okay, guys, good luck. We'll see you at the next lesson. Bye.